Business News Now. The importance of collaboration in business lies in the belief that together more can be done. Progress and giant strides can also be achieved through synergy. Well, this was the first, the thrust of one day seminar organized by Amplify Your Purpose Business Mixer for emerging African business leaders, entrepreneurs, and C suite executives by reputable and platforms. Speakers at the event emphasized the need for entrepreneurs, African leaders to collaborate and foster relationships to amplify and grow their businesses. A lot of businesses, people die solo because they want to shine alone, because they want to be the only one that, that is being talked about, they want to be the only one that is being recognized, they want to be the only one that is being awarded and rewarded. But when you find out that when you collaborate, you make more progress, you make more giant strides. So the beauty of collaboration is synergizing with your strength, right? And then you can win more. It's better to win 50% of your success rate than to lose 100% because you're doing things alone. Most of them think it is about social media. It's not about social media. It's about very many things that come into play. So it starts from, yes, the idea. It starts from the concept of what you want to do. But what you want to do must be predicated on something that you want to solve or a need that you found, a solution that is coming to a challenge, a problem. And in that lies the opportunity to understand not just the end users, what the motivation is. And so you go craft whatever service or good is for them. Then you start the process of brand building. Every business owner needs to be nurtured, right? Because a brand is like a child that you nurture from, you know, tender infant, infantile age up till maturity. The American economy is built on uh, small businesses. And that is also possible here. But what they've done over there is that they've ensured all necessary infrastructure that would enable businesses to thrive. That is the same thing we need to replicate here. We need to be able to create platforms and opportunity for young businesses to thrive. You need to believe in yourself. You need to believe in the beauty and your innate potential. You need to believe in your brand before you start thinking of how to put it out there. You cannot just wake up tomorrow and you want to be famous. It's not microwave generation that's, you know. So you have to believe in the beauty of your innate potential. You have to believe that you can offer something. You have to believe that I have found a problem. I want to create a solution. And in creating that solution, I intend to amplify my purpose so that other people across the continent can see and understand what I'm trying to do. So first, you must believe in your brand. You must have something to offer before you start thinking of giving yourself global visibility or international recognition. What they need to do is to exercise patience. They need to understand the essence of getting professionals to help you on the journey. And once that happens, your chances of eating the target is so... It's a lot more than just going blind, I mean, in the dark. There isn't a system of where you have people who have done it, create a, a system where young people can be mentored, but which is needed. But one of the things I'd like to say is that, yes, there are challenges. Yes, there might not be a mentorship system in place. However, the innovative spirit of the young African will always find a way, and most times they learn along the way. So mentorship is needed, but young people will always find a way. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.